Yo, what's going on guys? In today's video, we'll be testing out my newly buffed hog deck. In the first match, this guy has barbarians, probably gonna be a lava hound deck. One nice hog hit though. I'll go for the log. The log nerf is actually pretty noticeable, but I feel like this deck is still so much better now because of the really good firecracker buff. I'll go for the knight here for his minor. Nice catch. This will be a really hard matchup. He probably has arrows as well. Yeah, he will lava hound now. I'll go for the firecracker first and then the hog rider after. You always want to go with your firecracker first so you can get to a second one if they try to arrow your first one. Might already be a good game, but I don't know. There's a small chance I can defend. I don't want to overcommit too much on the Inferno Dragon. I'll just go for the Ice Spirit. Pretty bad arrows by him. I'll actually go for the Knight here as well, just apply some pressure. Probably force out Skelly Drags, yeah. I'll go for the Firecracker now. I kind of want to save my Tesla for a Balloon, and I'll go for a Defensive Hog Rider. Wait, no. <laughs> okay, I might be kind of dead right now. I'm going to go for the Ice Spirit and then just Knight to kill this Miner. Pretty awkward spot to be in. He will balloon. Good thing I saved my Tesla. I knew I couldn't waste my Tesla there. I'll go for the high Tesla now. And we should be fine. Alright. Um, not even the best Inferno Dragon by him either. Still a couple of night hits. We can counter his Inferno Dragon pretty easily. Even if he tries to zap our skeletons, we do have the Hog Rider to pull it back. I'll go for the Skellies. He will prediction arrows. I'll just go for the Hog Rider. I'll Ice Spirit as well just to be safe. Not take too much damage. Looks like that will be tower down. Really good start. By the way guys, we do have Knight in this deck as well. Knight did receive a 3% HP buff. Definitely a bit better than before. I'll go for the Knight now for some pressure. He will lava in the back. Okay, I'm going to go for the Firecracker. We basically just have to defend this big lava push now to win. I'm going to go for the early Tesla. And I'll log all of this away. You always have to go for the early Tesla too, so you can get to a second Tesla. I'm going to go for the Knight for his minor. Beautiful catch. Really good Tesla too. Gonna kill his Skelly Drags. I'll go for my second Tesla now. That's why you cycle your Teslas really early. <laughs> this guy can't believe it. We're playing so well, guys. Because this matchup is actually pretty difficult. Looks like that will be a good game. I'll see you guys in the next match. We got the next match. I'll go for the Hog Rider first play. Oh, we're gonna get Golem first played. I'll go for the Skeletons too. Should take out his entire tower unless he plays something. He's gonna Bomber. That's a lot of damage though. Five Hog hits. I'll go for the Firecracker. You always want to cycle your Firecracker early against any beatdown deck. Oh, he's gonna E-Barbs. I'll go for the Tesla here. And then the Knight for his Bomber. I don't trust it. I'll go for the Log as well. And these skeletons. Okay, I have like nothing for the Lumberjack. I'm going to pull it towards the middle with the Ice Spirit. Oh no, I'm so dead. That's going to be so much damage. I can't Firecracker, otherwise I would just die to his next Golem push. Really bad start. Might already be a good game. It's so bad to go in the same lane as Golem. Well, we're not done yet, but... I'll go for the Hog Rider. He has no E-Barbs in cycle. Should be at least two hits here against the Mega Minion. Not bad. He is going to Golem again. <laughs> okay, I'm definitely going to BM this guy. But if I lose, I'm going to be really sad. I can't really stop the Mega Minion. I don't want to overcommit with my Knight. I'll go for the Knight here in front of the Firecracker. Make sure he can't kill it. Too early at least. He probably has arrows though. What? How did that go for the Firecracker? My poor firecracker. Okay, I might be kind of dead right now. Um, I'll go for the skellies, pull his lumberjack up, and then I'll go for another firecracker. Good thing I played my first one early. Really good firecracker splash. I'll log away his bomber. Oh! <laughs> okay, I'll go for the ice spirit here. Uh, kill everything. Beautiful ice spirit. Guys, did you see what just happened? <laughs> I'm gonna BM him. He just activated our king tower with arrows. Average golem player. <laughs> Well, we have a thing here on the channel, if you guys don't know, where you have to subscribe if my opponents miss a spell or a building. So hey, feel free to subscribe if you are enjoying this beatdown of this golem player. <laughs> okay, we're looking pretty good, but this could change at any instant. 
I'm gonna go for a Hog Rider. He has no E barbs. I don't really care. Should take out most of his tower. I'm gonna Earthquake as well. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna thank this guy. As long as I don't choke. I'll go for a Firecracker again. Um, this could be a bit hard to defend. Hope I don't speak too soon. I need another Firecracker really quickly. Okay, I'll go for the Firecracker and he has no arrows in cycle now. King Tower is going to be huge. I'll go for a second Tesla and I'll pull everything towards the middle with the Ice Spirit. <laughs> hey, thank you very much, Mr. Golem player. Wait, I'm going to log the Bomber? A little bit close, a little bit close. I'm not sure how much damage level 13 Earthquake does. I'll just go for the Hog Rider to be safe. <laughs> thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. Me, 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 me. Good game. We got a match up against this guy. I'll cycle the Ice Spirit. Gonna play my Log as well. He has Goblin Gang. Probably not gonna be a Log Bait deck, though. I think almost no one runs Log Bait now after the nerf. Whoa, really bad NATO. I'll go for the Knight and then for the Hall Rider. I still have no idea what he's running, though. Okay, I'll play the Earthquake for his cannon. Should be a lot of damage. Oh, of course he would have a Mega Knight. What is this mid ladder menace sec? We have no Knight in cycle though, so it could be a bit hard to stop the Mega Knight. I think I'll try to activate my King Tower. I'll log his Dark Goblin, then go for the Ice Spirit. And the Skeletons. Beautiful. I'll go for the Knight here for his Goblin Gang. Should fully counter it. Super good King Tower activation against the Mega Knight. It feels so nice getting the King Tower activation against Mega Knight when I play against these helpless mid ladder players. <laughs> he does have quite a few hog counters though, whatever he's running. I'll set up the firecracker in the back. Also guys, sorry if I BM people a lot, I just feel like it. I'm gonna go for the Ice Spirit Hog Rider trick, try to bypass a potential tornado. <laughs> I knew right when I saw the tornado that he messed up the timing. <laughs> well hey, you guys have to subscribe. Again. <laughs> okay, I'll go for the Earthquake. Just make sure we take out his tower quickly. Oh, beautiful Rawl Gate. That was the most accurate Rawl Gate ever. Well, looks like that will be good game. I'll see you guys in the next match. We found a match. I'll go for the Hog Rider first play. See what he has. Oh no, he has Night Witch Snowball. That can only mean one thing. Giant graveyard. I'll go for the firecracker. Yeah, he has arrows. Definitely going to be giant graveyard. Such a bad matchup. It's so hard because they have the arrows for your firecracker and really hard to stop the graveyards. I'll cycle my log. It's a bit risky though. They can punish you for almost anything with a giant graveyard at the bridge. He has sparky. I'm going to go for the hog rider. That's interesting. I didn't expect him to have sparky. Nice two hog hits. I'll set up the Tesla here in the middle. Should snipe down one of the minions. Not bad. Minions do so much damage now. Oh, looks like he's not going to play anything. I'll go for the Skellies here for his Sparky. I'll play the Ice Spirit too. I was kind of scared he would try to go for a prediction spell. I'll go with the Firecracker for his Night Witch. I feel like so many people are going to start to use arrows now that Firecracker and Archers are so good because arrows are like the best counter. He's gonna giant. I'll go for the knight. What the heck? He has graveyard too? I'm gonna earthquake. Why does a man have giant graveyard sparky? I'm gonna log all of this back too. We could be in a bit of trouble. Okay, okay. That was a beautiful firecracker shot. Guys, why does this man have this? <laughs> why? I'll go for a hog rider and then for a prediction firecracker for minions. Let's go. Look how fast the firecracker shoots now. It's so good for making predictions with and getting chip damage on the tower. Beautiful firecracker. We have to go opposite lane of him since he has Sparky. Sparky is probably going to be pretty good now that Rocket got a big nerf. Rocket is so bad. Alright, I'll go for the Skellies here. Yeah, I kind of expected that Sparky. I'll go for a Hog Rider. Okay, he's going to go for the late Skarmy. I don't even want to go with my Earthquake onto it. I'll save the Earthquake for defense. I'll just set up the Tesla here. I want to get damage in both lanes. Just to be able to push wherever I want to. He's going to Giant Graveyard. I'll go for the Skelly's Distracted Sparky, then Defensive Earthquake. A Ice Spirit as well. Oh no, one minion. No, I'm going to Firecracker. 
Okay. I thought that one minion would get way more damage. I'll go for the Skelly Surround and then for a Hog Rider behind the Firecracker. Well, in front of the Firecracker. Oh, he got the King Tower activation. The only problem right now with the new Firecracker is that it's so easy for the opponents to activate their King Tower. I'll set up the Firecracker here. He's going to Sparky. I'll go for the Hog Rider. He has the arrows. <laughs> Wait, he missed the arrows. Guys, my opponents are missing endless spells today. This is unreal. <laughs> I'll set up the Tusley. He's probably going to go with his giant graveyard, to be honest. Pretty even right now. I'll go for a high firecracker. Should splash everything. Okay, I'm in a bit of trouble. Um, I'm going to go for the defensive earthquake, then for an ice spirit. Kill the Sparky. I'll go for the log here as well. And another firecracker. He has no arrows in cycle. I'll go for the hog rider. We need some damage right now. It's so hard to get damage though against his snowball. Yeah, he's gonna snowball. I'll go for the knight here. He probably has to go with his Skarmy onto it, so I'll go for a prediction log. Beautiful. And I'll go for another firecracker here on the right side. He has to play something, I think. That should be a lot of damage. Okay, I'm gonna go for the hog rider. He's gonna giant graveyard. Oh no, I need elixir quickly. Uh, earthquake. Okay. Log as well. This will be so close. I'm going to go for a firecracker. He wasted the arrows again. I'll go with the hog rider. Should be one hog hit unless he plays something. He's going to snowball. I'll take that honestly. I'm going to earthquake this sparky. Just slow it down a bit. Allow the firecracker to kill it. I'll set up the tesla. Oh no. <laughs> um, Earthquake. Oh let's go. Let's go. I'm going to log and that will be good game. We're in the next match. I'll cycle the Ice Spirit. You know what, guys? I don't care. I'll BM this guy, too. <laughs> it's my only way of having fun in mid ladder. I'm sorry. This guy might have 3.0 Expo. I'll go for the Firecracker, then for the Hog Rider. Oh, he has Lumberjack. Could be a Balloon deck, actually. That Firecracker got so much chip damage. Firecracker is so good now. I'm having so much fun today. Okay, we do have Tesla. Oh, he's going to have recruits, okay. I'll go for the Earthquake. We do have Tesla for the Balloon, which is going to be kind of nice. I'm pretty sure he does have Balloon. No idea what else he could have. I'll go for the Early Firecracker. Does so well against recruits, even though we have no Valkyrie in this deck. I'm going to go for the High Knight and then for the Tesla here for his Balloon. This is going to be so hard, though, since he has arrows. Man, everyone's running arrows today. Really good Tesla, so nice to have the Tesla over the cannon or bomb tower. This deck does work though with the cannon if you really feel like it. But I feel like the Tesla is so nice for solid defense against everything, pretty much. I'll go for the Hog Rider. Guys, archers are like a machine gun now, they shoot so fast. Oh, he has fishermen. That's pretty bad for us, actually. Oh, let's go. Not even a King Tower activation for him because of how broken the archers are. I'll Ice Spirit for this one archer. And I'll just go with the Skellies. This matchup will be a bit difficult though, in double elixir. I'm gonna go for the Hog Rider try to get some nice early damage. He has no Fisherman in cycle, so not really sure what he's gonna do. He's gonna Eros, he has like no elixir. I'll play the Skellies here as well, since it's a raged up Inferno Dragon. <laughs> what a snowball! Guys, literally all of my opponents are missing spells today. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna log these archers. <laughs> I'll play another hog rider. Even if he tries to go for the fisherman, I don't really care too much. Still gonna be one hog hit. Nice. I'll set up the early firecracker. If he tries to arrow the first one. Yeah, we need another we need another firecracker uh, really quickly. I'll go for the log here, push everything back a bit. We're almost back to another Tesla. We are back to a Tesla now, in case he tries to balloon. Firecracker is so good when he has no arrows in cycle. I'll go for the Tesla here again. I think we should be fine. I'm going to log all of this back as well. And I'll play the Knight. Uh, might be one balloon hit. Never mind. <laughs> I'll go for the Hog Rider. Let's go. I'm going to BM this guy. I'm sorry. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. And see you in the next one. Bye.